Meineke Car Care Bowl, SEC versus Big 12, number 21 and number 12. We start this one off with Chris Relf giving it to Vic Ballard. Look at the spin move, 45 yards down the sideline. What a run to kick things off for the Bulldogs and then Ballard gets to finish it off here on the option play as he walks it in and the Bulldogs lead 7-0. Second quarter and this is when things go from good to bad for Mississippi State. Blaine Gabbert would find Wes Kemp for 45 yards. The completion sheds a tackler and gets inside the 5 yard line. They give it to Henry Josie, the running back, on the pass play for the touchdown, all tied up 7-7. After Mississippi State goes 3-and out, Gabbert finds LaDamian, LaDamian Washington, 60 yards for the touchdown, 14-7. Tigers take the lead over the Bulldogs, 14 unanswered. So let's take a look at this one one more time. Washington, well first Gabbert was under pressure, finds Washington the big hit and then sheds a tackle and he is gone off to the races 14 to 7 next possession for Mississippi State and Luke Lambert would come down with the interception to keep momentum in the favor of Missouri Gabbert to Henry Josie once again the running back look at him catch things 27 yards and now it is 21 to 7 look at the feet inbounds terrific footwork it's 21 to 7 Missouri has the lead 21 points unanswered as we go into the third quarter Jarrell Jackson take a look at the 29 yard catch and more poor tackling from the Bulldogs. That was the story of the game, the poor tackling from Mississippi State. They just couldn't bring anyone down out there. Wes Kemp, 24 yards down the middle to set up a 40-yard field goal that would be no good and give some momentum back to Mississippi State. As soon as we say that, though, they give it right back to the Tigers. Literally, 62-yard interception touchdown by Carl Geddes. Off of the option play, that makes it 28-7. Missouri over Mississippi State. We go to the fourth, and Mississippi State down by three scores with not a lot of time. However, Blaine Gabbert trying to put this one out of reach, fumbles it, and it's Mississippi State football. Rell would find Chad Bumpus, 57 yards. To the house, 28 to 14, cutting the lead down. Mizzou would go three and out on their next possession, so Mississippi State re gets the ball back. Brandon Heavens, 32 yard catch inside the five, and then he would finish the job on the next play for the touchdown catch, making it 28 21, cutting the lead to seven now. Another three and out for Missouri. And Mississippi State trying to make the comeback happen. Chris Smith, 23-yard catch. And then the next play would be an 8-yard catch on first down. You see Ralph connect with his receiver. So now it comes up second down and two. And it's dropped. Flat out dropped. Incomplete for Mississippi State. Third down and two. Ralph will try to do it himself. No, he gets stopped for no yard. Fourth and two, they go deep, incomplete, and the Missouri defense holds a turnover on down, and Missouri will get out of here with a 28-21 victory. No playoff game today decided by more than seven points. It has been close, and that's what happens when you put the best of the best against each other. The Big 12, though, better than the SEC on this day. Blaine Gabbert, three touchdowns, no interceptions, nearly 400 yards passing. Moore and Posey were all over the place, and what an effort by Luke Lambert. The Missouri Tigers, they'll be headed on to round two.